At this time I'm going to show you how to use the drag and drop feature for uploading course resources including the syllabus to e-learning. This was a new enhancement that was just added recently and it is very powerful and it can be used for all types of resources that can be added to a course page. So we need to turn editing on where you have all these little icons and then we need to open our file browser where we have our course files. And then the next thing that we need to do is we need to click on the file that we want to drag and drop to the course. So all we have to do here is we click on the syllabus. In this case, it's in PDF. And I just hold it down and then drag it to uh, the very top of the course. Then just let it go. And then the syllabus in this point has been posted. The same way you could post other resources and other video lectures so we go back to our resources here and let's say we go to under hardware and we drag this PowerPoint over here to the topic number one. Now if the PowerPoint is pretty large it's going to take a little time to upload it but that's how easy it is to use the drag and drop feature. You can use this for Word documents, for PDF files, PowerPoints and other types of resources. At this point we did upload the course syllabus and the syllabus should be ready for the students to download it. If you want to rename the course, the wording here for the syllabus, you can click on the black pencil here and choose course syllabus. And then hit enter. Otherwise it will not save the name change. If you wanted to edit this further, you can click on update and then customize other settings that you may prefer to customize. Another method of uploading a resource to e-learning or the course syllabus to e-learning is doing the manual way or the longer way like we used to do it uh, in the previous versions of e-learning. You can click on add an activity or resource. Then you'd click on add a file under resources. Click on add. Then you'll give it a name. You can put a description if you'd like to and then post this description on the front page if you choose to. And then under content you can either drag the files here or you can click on add. And then you can basically add files from a variety of ways. You can choose to upload the file from your computer, from recent files that you have used or private files that you may have in e-learning. Uh, the most commonly used option here is upload a file from your computer. This is by default what shows up. Then what you need to do is you'll need to click on choose file. And at this point it's very similar to just attaching a file to an email. So then we go to wherever you have your files and then pick the syllabus from there and then click on open. Leave the rest of the options uh, the way they are and then click on upload this file. Then under the display, uh, force download is the most commonly used option. However, you can choose here open as well. Automatic, it's not really recommended for PDF files. Sometimes they may not open correctly. And then all you have to do is click on save and return to the course. Note that the syllabus has been posted a second time. And then I can click on, on it. It'll save it. You'll be able to open it. If you wanted to delete one of those options or one of those instances, like we uploaded two of them, you can click on the delete icon and that will remove it from the course page. So that's how you upload the syllabus to the, to the course and upload other resources using the drag and drop tool.